All right, here we go into a brand new world of streaking, aka plus one over my previous record. Let's keep going. Well, definitely not taking any of those. Third turn ghost, I think, is playable. Add Slimer is difficult, also playable. Hero Vigil. How the hell is this a 10? Excuse me? <laughs> Some of these curses and blessings are severely undercosted or overcosted. This is the case of one being overcosted as hell. I would evaluate this at like a three or some shit. Actually, no. No, no, it's not a three because everybody gets. Okay. I would evaluate this at like a five or six at most. Because it means that like for it to even activate, somebody has to die. Which is not good. Maybe a six. I'd give it like a six. I mean, it is broken on some characters because like quad use, for example, or double use. But again, you have to lose a character, which is I mean, I don't know. It's like maybe you take somebody with a death side and you just kill it. So like or pain. I don't know. It's not that bad, but is it a 10? Hell no. Hell no. Spikey's easy. And a magic comp. Bear could have died to it before. I think item poison is also like very playable. Essence thief is interesting. I don't hate this actually. I think this is like pretty decent for three. I'm looking at I don't know, I think item poison is annoying. I actually don't know. I like for I used to evaluate barricade very highly, as in like very easy, but it did actually wreck me a few times. And I, I think that's kinda I'm maybe changing my mind on barricade. I think it's I think it's dependent on you having a defensive team comp, which you could argue, oh my god. Oh shit. Uh, I mean, my team comp is insane though, so... This is always happening, I think. And then the question is, what else do I want? I think bot jammed is really doable as well, but eh, it's pretty annoying. Apparently item poison is one of the easier things, and I would say that's probably the case. But like starting with two poison late game can be problematic, but eh. I guess by that point you just hope you can cleanse it somehow. I'm I'm really tempted by Essence Thief, but it would force me into taking like Barricade or something, and then a two. Also, Arthritis is very bad with Item Poison, so maybe I would look for Slippery Dice here, which is pretty easy. Is okay. Is essence thief essence thief really worth a barricade trade? Basically, well, I guess what else are we doing? I have no way of getting to eleven without a five. There's only one five. I don't know. I'm like, I don't hate the ghost, but I also kind of hate the ghost. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> also doesn't really have any synergy with anything but bot jammed because the numbers here don't add up. Or I would have to take SNC, which, which I think is like kind of good, but...
I'm a little bit scared of this in the magic team comp because your burst potential is lower. It's very difficult to do six damage immediately. So if this comes down, I'm probably gonna have to eat the damage. Now, is that fine? Maybe. Is bot jam that bad? Pretty bad. It's pretty bad. I think it's even worse on the reds, right? Mm -hmm. So like here, that would be brutal. Pretty bad here, pretty, really bad there. Fine here. Annoying. Annoying, very annoying. Fine. Annoying, annoying. It's like, it's like really annoying, I think at most. I wouldn't say it's like super bad, but it's just a pain to deal with. Also, you have to consider that, again, add Ghost in a Magic party is definitely worse than it would be otherwise. Burst potential is lower. I mean, my team comp is good, but with Meddler, this is probably going to spawn. And the question is, can I deal with the 4 damage descend? I guess I have Wallop, which is very good against Ghost. I want to try to get this, but I have to... Okay, I mean, to get that, I would have to do... The spiky with Ghost is pretty dangerous. Item Poison is annoying as well. I'm pretty scared of Ad Ghost. I feel like it could just randomly end my run. Is Ghost... Okay, how much more powerful is Ghost than Slimer? Because technically... Yeah, it's it's like way easier, right? Like, turn 3 Ghost is way easier than just Slimer. So I guess the, the difference between 6 and 8 cost is probably... It makes Ghost more tempting. Because it feels like it's under-costed. Kinda. Eh. Actually, I don't know. I mean, Ghost... Ghost is arguably scarier than Slimer. What else was it? What was the other option? It was like poison, spiky. Slippery. It's kind of... Uh, I don't have to take another two. It's kind of like... I don't know if I want to combine item poison with arthritis. That's the issue here. You can look at it like me taking a tick of, of two poison on turn one, which is really bad. Also, max HP is better when you have a healer, so lowering your max HP when you have a healer is probably a bad idea. This would be better in a force comp, I think, where HP matters less, so this is more problematic. I would say this is pretty free and this is pretty free, so we have six points that are pretty free. You could also argue that small bonus is very easy. Uh, because if I combine it with SNC, if I can just farm all the small mobs. The problem is, how do I do that? I would need another two. I already have item poison. Okay, this is like... Uh, hmm. Definitely a slight problem here. Maybe barricade is actually not that bad. I mean, barricade is probably easier than item poison. I think I'm always taking spiky monsters, so then the question is like, what else do I do? So we had five. I could take all the threes and just dodge item poison. It depends how much... I don't know. I, it's hard for me to evaluate item poison. I actually never played with it. I've heard that it was pretty easy. 
And I can I can imagine that that might be the case. I don't know. I'm scared of barricade. I'm really scared of barricade. Now that I lost to it. I think it just it just makes killing big monsters that much harder. And that is a genuine problem sometimes when you don't have the defense to like sustain yourself. I would almost say it's harder than item poison. I don't know if I'd want to take both, because they're both bad in drawn out fights. Like this is this draws the fight out, and this also punishes you for dragging the fight on. So both of those are very bad. I think add ghost is a possibility. With with the essence thief speeding up my potential kill power. And I just go slippery small bonus. Spiky, Essence, Slippery, Small I think that's playable. I think that's playable. I don't think the ghost is like... Necessarily run ending. Even if it does spawn. The problem is that it will... Well, the, I'm just happy I have Wallop. Basically, Wallop is... A very good sign, and if I if I manage to somehow hit the um, if I manage to somehow hit Pilgrim, we are in a great spot. And in some cases, it might be okay as well. I might be able to build defensively enough where this does not matter. Definitely a possibility. But yeah, let's uh, let's do it. I think it's fine. I think Essence Thief is definitely worth it. Especially because I don't have like a clean 11. I don't have a clean 11 at all. Oh my god, Meddler. I love you so much. Keep doing what you're doing, buddy. Druid is fine. <clears throat> Sparky is... I said I was going to try Sparky, and it does replace Meddler, so... <laughs> Alright, Sparky, you're up, buddy. Now, the problem is with Spiky, it's definitely worse than it would be otherwise, but it's not that much worse. Alright, I can see... I'm, I'm, already, I'm already starting to see some bad shit here. <laughs> My only problem with Sparky is this side. I think the charge side is absolute ass cheeks. Until you get to like a certain point, I guess, but... Good old zap. Mm. I forgot I would gain one mana too. Mm. Whatever. Probably kill it next turn. Get the charge for Sparky. <laughs> hey, two damage. Yippee! It's not even good. <laughs> Does it say two or less? Oh, not exactly two. What a pain. Seedling covering is actually okay. It has synergy with Sparky because I can charge more mana up. Also good with healers in general. I have to put this on somebody who is going to take damage from the Spiky. So most likely just Brigand. Also, it puts it out of range of a thorn, 
five damage hit. Oh no, wait, it's six now. Oof. Yikes. Monk Medic. I like both of these. I think they're very, very solid, but now you're going to start to see Sparky have some issues because this only generates two mana. But you know what? I kind of value Monk pretty highly. I think Monk is good because it has the cleanse and it also has access to redirect against the, against the ghost. That's going to be pretty clutch. So I might be looking at Monk here. I think there are better tier two reds as well. Like sure, there are somewhat better tier two grays, but I think Monk is like really solid, especially with the healer. Um, wouldn't necessarily want Fae. Vampire would be amazing. Anything with double mana gen, I think is just better. Yeah, it's probably, it's just better. No stun though, but. Ah, yeah, whatever. I still think it's better. Like, Splint is not good, but... Monk is very good, so... Also, Monk is good at redirecting spiky damage, which is kind of cool. Splint isn't that bad sometimes. I mean, it's really good with Monk actually having that that five heal stick. Pretty nasty. All right, Sparky, you're really cooking now, eh? With that, with the plus one stored mana, it makes Sparky better for sure. I think foil is okay. Spinachi? What the hell? This is so ass. I mean, is it though? It's not... Okay. It's not that bad. I do have the empty max HP, and also, if somebody dies, I guess it just kind of heals them back up. Which is kind of cool. It might be more... interesting... And foil? That's a very weird question to ask here, because I, I don't know. Like, full, foil's average outcome, or average impact on the game, is, like, pretty mediocre. I mean, it's pretty good with, like, two of these, which are good. Good units. This is a little bit less good with the shielding, obviously. Probably wouldn't pick it. But most units have a, have a right side, and they don't want to replace it. So it'd only be, like, somewhat useful. I don't think it's that useful at all, actually. It might just be a throw, throw away. And okay there. I guess it's, like, okay-ish there. I wouldn't replace any mana sides. Yeah, that's the problem. It's good here. I don't know. Maybe it, maybe it is better than most... Like, maybe it is better than Spinach, because Spinach is so... Then again, I have to also consider that Ghost might be spawning and killing one of my units, so I'll take Spinach. I think I'm leaning towards Spinach because of this as well. Not that relevant, but... It has some application immediately. Splint is absolutely cooking... Okay, wait, there was a downside to Monk, and it was the spikes. I did not consider that. Definitely something I should have been on the lookout for. <laughs> Hell no. Rouge? Oh, Herbalist is so good. Very bad at healing, though. I mean, not really. I mean, it's okay at healing. It's, it's like a... I don't know, Harbless is one of my favorites here too, so... But I also really, really like Rogue, so... 
I'm gonna take Garbos though for the replacement on Splint, which is kind of gonna fall off very quickly here. Hopefully I hit like a juggler. Juggler would be better. Oh no wait, juggler is terrible. Oh wait, actually rogue is terrible. <laughs> yeah, I for totally forgot about spikes. Should I have to pay more attention? Is that a weekend? Yeah, it is. Not a weekend anymore. Good team comp. Good with Sparky so far. A little stick there. Vine is just really clean. Actually, Vine, this might be the ideal setup because Vine helps so much for setting up Zap. Ladder? Does it replace the middle side with the heroes above the base side? Two mana. Wait, that makes Sparky significantly stronger. I do like the range, but I think this is more useful. Wait, replace the middle side with a hero above the bit. Yeah, it's, it is better, right? I do think this is a really nasty item, though, when, when things have spiky. I'm considering it. Is ladder that good later? That's a good question, right? Like, I don't know if I would ever copy that. I would... No, my orange is at the top. I have to consider my orange being at the top. That's kind of a problem. I guess this would be cool. Are there that many characters where you're, where I'm like, okay, yeah, I really want to grab your middle. Well, here, that would be, oh, that would be on gray though. That wouldn't work. Red copying gray. I don't think they'd want that. But I'm looking at like, I'm mostly looking at blue copying red, right? No, 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 absolutely not. Yes. No. Yes. Absolutely yes. Huh. This will be useful until we get to the point where this becomes more useful. Hmm. It's already useful right now, that's the thing. That's kind of a tough one, actually, because right now this is more useful by far than ladder. I wouldn't hate like putting it here, for example. Most tier twos. OK, I have to look at tier two orange and tier two. So no, 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 probably not, probably not. Yes. So only a few can really use it, and then we have no, nope. mm, probably not, no, nope. sure, no, nope. no, nope. sure, but terrible, terrible. Unit. Okay, so it's not that good. Like it's it's not that good. I'm, I'm gonna take louder then. Ladder has potential, a uh, more potential. Monk. Not doing too hot here. Spiky really annoying here. I'm looking for mana, right? I need I need a bunch of mana to nuke that. There's one. I would like mana or poison here. Good team comp. Really good. Mana, damage, mana. Sparky, please, yep. Sparky, why are you cooking? Stop cooking. I need to be a Sparky hater for the rest of my days. Oh, shit.
Man, I, I, I hate this. Is a, it's been a while since we've seen a juggler, and it's pissing me off that I have to not take it. And Scrapper is. <sighs> Scrapper is good. I mean, it can kill ghosts through it, yeah. Whatever. It's not like. I wouldn't say it's spectacular, but. I don't know, it's fine, whatever. Like, it's the only way I can power through a ghost, potentially. Even powering through Githa, I guess. I just hate that it has no synergy with Monk, but eventually it will. Scrapper Steel Side, is it really correct for me to lock a Scrapper Steel Side here? I think it's probably bloodlust. I think I'm looking to just. Yeah, I have to roll, I think. It's a little bit scary, actually. Do I have to roll this, really? Maybe I, maybe I have to lock it because it's just better than nothing. The region side isn't horrible. I mean, I guess the mana side is better than the steel side. You just bank the mana. Poison's fine. What's worse, the descend or the githa? get those worse maybe I don't know that's uh ugh. also the ghost is definitely coming actually Zab is really good against ghost okay Sparky was actually a good pick here for once so this if it's gonna hit this it'll go, it'll go on scrapper which is fine so it's probably it's probably Magra then All right, now we can hit the stick. Ah, uh, why did Agnes summon the wolf? That's like the worst case scenario. Weaken is really bad. I mean, this will low-key kill the monk, so I can't, I can't keep that. Stick. Mana shield. Okay, wait, this is interesting. Oh, wait, Sparky, why are you cooking, my friend? What the hell? Why are you, what are you doing? I told you not to cook. Six. I refuse to let you cook, Sparky. Wait, I have to kill, I think, um, hmm. I don't really do this, because I, I could get the three damage, potentially. But it's not enough to kill Agnes. Uh, maybe I let Magret actually go free. Wait, what? Why is it, why is it five? Oh. Went a little bit too deep there. Oh, now both are dying. Oh yeah, because Wolf is also targeting Monk. That is not good. What was that targeting? Weaken? Maybe I have to... Mm, no, I, I can't let that go. I mean, it's easier for me to just kill Magret and then just heal up the... Heal the monk up, I guess. 
Is that really what I need to do? You know, I don't have the mana to kill this. I'm one off. Uh, I can kill the wolf. Which still kills the monk, so... <laughs> what is this disaster? Maybe... Is there something I'm not seeing? Like... That... No. That's the worst, right? That's worse because I'm not using Zap. Same thing, right? But then Scrapper takes one damage. What a pain. Is there an, a line where I just kill the wolf? I don't think so. I think I just have to do this. Ghost is coming to screw me over, though. And Agnes is going to be a pain. Oh, shit. Really bad. I don't know if killing the wolf is actually good enough, though. I guess I can try. Okay. I can accept this, but then the ghost comes in and picks me over it. At least the wolf is gone. It's better than shielding the monk, right? I'm basically banking. I'm trading two mana for a dead wolf. Probably worth it. Alright, maybe it wasn't worth it. I mean, this is like actually worst case scenario, though. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think about this, but it seems like this is kind of looking real bad. I need to do four. I kill Agnes, I can save Sparky, but I won't be able to save Herbalist, which might be okay. I think my goal is to kill, kill Agnes here. If I get really lucky, I could kill the ghost here, but it's most likely not happening. This could also roll into a five heal. <clears throat> a five heal, which would, I think, be better. Am I happier if this rolls a shield? Two damage, then we have two more damage. So two, two, and then I need three mana. Actually, that's like almost impossible. It's my goal to just survive this turn then, instead of attacking. Regen saves a monk. Obviously, five heal would be good, but otherwise, two damage is the best I can do if I'm trying to kill this. But I don't think I can kill it and also save Sparky, right? So let's say two. Let's say that this rolls two mana, which is the best case scenario. Um. That'd be four damage. And then I need three, which cannot happen basically, because Scrapper is a low damage unit without Bloodlust. I mean, it'll be two damage. So I think my goal is to survive here. I need the... I guess redirect is not horrible. Might need the shield from this, but how do I, how do I win? That's the question. I guess I can bank the mana for next turn. I could also just redirect, sacrifice the monk, and go ham. 
which I think is the better option. Yeah, I think I have to sacrifice the monk here. It's not too bad. We have the spinach. I'm going to lock the two damage. Go for redirect. Go for mana. Go for mana. Potential shield here. What? Okay, that's a little bit terrifying. Okay, good. Whoa. Oh, holy shit, that's... I think that's jackpot. That's the only side that could have done anything. I think it just did. Whoa, that's crazy. So I can gain some life here by going here. Well, that was really lucky. Honestly, I could have lost the game there. Like that, that triple blank was so disgustingly bad that uh, I'm very thankful that I made up for it. Like that, that triple blank was disgusting. <laughs> that almost screwed me over so hard, but then the game just redeemed itself. That was really scary. This fight is very hard with, with spiky monsters and with ghosts spawning in three turns. Specifically because Agnes rolled the summon wolf on turn one, which was the worst case scenario for me. So, yeah. And we made it through. Holy shit. I can't believe it. Okay, natural is very, 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 very good. Now Sparky is a disgustingly good unit. I think. Probably. Yeah, that fight is nonsense. The sisters, I feel like they can always end your run, but specifically with the ghost spawning in three turns, that's like, that's terrifying. And with and with um, the spiky adding a little bit of damage on my side, really terrifying. Spellblade? Spellblade really good with Sparky. Copy catch. Hmm. I don't think copy cat is good. I guess I could copy charged, which is interesting, but it's very narrow. Probably Spellblade. More mana gen means Scrapper's better, means Sparky's better. Zombie's really annoying. But my Scrapper can deal for. Wrong side there. Do I want to lock? Okay, so do I... What's my goal here? I think just kill ghost, right? Yeah. So I should lock this. That's correct. Maybe that's fine. One, two, shield. Shield, three, zap. Do I want a two tick poison here? Or do I want to... Amplify the damage of a, of a different attack next turn to kill the zombie. Probably better. Could roll the stick that way as well. I think I can lock this so we can go. Mm. 
Sack of mana. Uh, Loki is just better than this side. Oh, it does blank top bottom shit. Forgot about that. Okay, wait, that's actually insane. Yeah, that that's uh that's giga cracked actually. What spell plane? Absolutely not. Okay, Spellblade is, uh, oof, well, this is good. Okay, it's looking good. Damage output online. In low key, I just keep that. Let's go two, two, one. Wait, no, I got a one here, probably. Two, four, sap. Shit. I guess I just do this instead. Whenever I have the stick now online. Wait, what? Did I already use an ability? Wander Kronos. Okay, Kronos is looking mighty spicy here. Also, Wander is insane. Damn, this is... It's kind of hard, actually. I don't think Scrapper is very good. I think Sparky is better than Scrapper right now. Uh, the reason Kronos is so spicy is because of the... The tick almost guaranteed to happen. That's pretty nasty. Um, but I think it's, it's pretty difficult for me to justify cutting a Wanderer here when my team wants to be a little bit defensive. And um, also Scrapper's just not very good right now. Like, no, I mean, it's good, it's good, but it's not like... It's not Wanderer good. Where this can like shield when I need it. It's also more consistent. When the ghost spawns, this will be at three, or I mean five, which means I can just ping the ghost with a vine and kill it. Now this has more like, yeah, it's better in a defensive comp to have like some form of scaling. Also the burst damage potential. I think it's just, it's just gotta be wander. It's just more consistent. And a little added, a little bit of added shield is gonna be good for this team comp, I think. Monk want to get too poisoned? Um, maybe. All right, Sparky stick, please. Hmm. 
I do not like this double poison nonsense, but I think it's just fine. I'll just go... Regen. Stick. Oops. Stick. Redirect itself. Probably fine. Should be able to kill this turn. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I totally forgot about Ghost. <laughs> ah, classic misplay. I was not calculating Ghost there at all, which was probably a bad play, but I should roll this for mana, right? If I can just one-shot both of them. I mean, this doesn't matter, so it's mostly Ghost. I need to roll for mana to guarantee the Ghost leaves. It's almost already guaranteed though, right? I can just do 4 and 2, so I should keep that maybe. I could keep everything. I can go like here, here, here. Is regen a keyword? It is. Wait a minute. It's even more sick. Wait, that's actually... I didn't even think that was a combo. For some reason. But it is. Awesome. The extra mana on the bank is pretty nice here. Scales rightmost to maximum of other sides. Now, is that a scaling pip? No, it's not, right? It's a static, so like, it won't scale with the era. Kind of worthless, actually. Remove all keywords from all sides. So three, no oh, that's a nothing. Yeah, I can't do that. <laughs> Wait, when is this good again? It's good again. It's good if I roll. Well, we're off the yellows. It would have been good with Barb, obviously. But. Uh... I don't think it's that good on anything else. I guess it's kind of good on the death side, so like... Yeah, but then it removes the weaken, isn't it? Wait, when is that item good? Oh, it's good. It's really good here. Oh, wait, no. Wait, it's not even good. Wait, when is it? When is that item good? I can't, I can't even, like, begin to imagine where it's good. Here? Here it's good. Yeah, here it's good. But... That, why can I not find multiple characters that are really good with that? I don't understand. What what characters have, like, really insane synergy? I can't see much at all. What the hell? When do you want to use that? Karma's insane. Wait. This doesn't apply regen to yourself, right? No. I mean, I guess karma's not... Self-shield to shield sides? Wait, does it work? I, I need to test that. I don't think it does. Wait, self-heal. Heal myself for one. Yeah, it doesn't do the spell to yourself, no. No, no. And here it would be... It wouldn't be too bad either, but I want to test this, because, like, I could always be wrong. Cool. Cool. I mean, I guess. Not too bad. So... Oh wait, how do I... Hmm. I can do Giga Repel. Can 
goddamn demon. The literal demon. Alright, I'll bank the fort. Bank the fort. Oh. Stick. I guess we can test this now. Okay. Confirmed. This might be good enough still. Oh shit. That's a non-bow. Stick. Team comps are really flowing good here. Oh, it's nice. Boost is okay. Artificer is fucking dog shit. <laughs> I mean, actually, it's again like remove all keywords. I don't know. It's kind of good, I guess, but yeah, I would say yeah, it is kind of good on Artificer, but I have to hit exactly that. So, how do I feel about Poet? So, Poet has self shield. Self shield, so yeah, it's kind of nasty. Oh, it's kind of it's kind of real nasty actually. No cleanse though. There's no amaranth because I can hit ghast and that would be a disaster. Just looking at some of the grays here, I guess there's not that much cleanse. Yeah, I should probably take it. It's fine. Plus one HP on anybody. Maybe on you, because you have the defy side. Yeah, Poet's going to be pretty dirty here, because like every time it hits the cantrip, it shields itself, which is insane. Although, cantrip shield a little bit of a non-bow with wander, but again, if we're going for like a kind of stall-y comp, it's kind of okay. I mean, we don't want to stall too long, obviously, but... Long enough for wanderer to do something. Oh. Oh. Interesting. I kind of forgot about that synergy as well. <laughs> That's a thing. That can happen sometimes. Self-shield, by the way. Bank. Weekend's annoying, I have no cleanse, but I mean the karma's just carrying here, I think. Probably. Oh, I forgot but the poison side's not too bad. I should have maybe kept that. Never mind. Just hit the Giga again. Very easy run so far, but you never know. The, the thing is, with a comp like this, you don't find cleanse, you could be in trouble in some cases. That's the only scary part about this. Is that I kind of need cleanse. Room. is good with Spellblade. Self shield tall damage. That's kind of nasty, actually. Holy shit. Wow, that is disgusting. <laughs> that, that is actually disgusting on Wanderer. I think that's better. Make sure we have a lot of defense, but you never know. Like, I, I could hit Hexia and then I just want to... Well, I guess Hexia is pretty easy in this case, but... I don't know. Shroom is like... It's really solid. It's like, it's actually really good, but. Once I replace Spell Blade, it won't be good here. It will be good there. It will be good there. It's like fine there. Pretty bad here. Actually, like unplayable here. Not, not good there. Fine. Fine. Like, it's kind of okay. 
wouldn't be good on any of the healers, right? Actually, maybe. I guess probably fine here. Probably fine here. Probably fine here. <clears throat> I don't know, it's all like fine, but this is kind of insane. Like, I, I don't know where when I would ever consider not taking this, because... It's just so good that I don't have to worry about Wander anymore. Like, I just, I just ignore it. It's doing its own thing. Poet can do the big shield on somebody else. I think that's more valuable than anything else. I think that self shield is nasty. This was kind of it was it is kind of cool to put extra stuff on on spellblade, but whatever. I don't care that much. I kind of want to lock this, but I, don't, I know I can't. I can maybe lock that. Go further, I guess, and go for a two shield, I guess. Kind of down for that. Good boost. Kind of overkill, but who cares? Oops. Whatever, when am I going to use boost anyways? Oh, maybe when the ghost is here. <laughs> maybe I should have waited for the ghost to come, but... So that is indeed a 5, right? Yep. Wait, how does this work? Oh god. Oh, it does copy era. Oh shit. Kind of nasty, actually. Oh my god. Oh. Holy moly. Wait, why it copied so? Oh my god, it copied so. What the hell? Spell it is insane. Wait, I need copycat. That is kind of unbalanced, actually. What the hell? I don't even care about the. Dude, fuck the ghost, I don't, I don't care. Who cares about a ghost? Just gotta make sure to not finish this with uh, this unit. But I mean, even if I do, I can just put the spinach on it, it's fine. Witchet? Inspire. So this could hold Doomblade. Which makes Wizard a little bit better. I mean, Witch is like totally fine. I don't know. Witch has a Witch has a cleanse. That's very tempting to me. Also, boost is nasty with Spellblade. But I guess it's it'll fall off once Spellblade is gone. It's also good at with the this thing. What's left on the table for blue? Like, what am I specifically looking for? I guess probably Warlock, Sork, Warlock, Sork. Maybe Ace, I don't know, I kinda hate it. Uh, Weaver, I guess? Yeah, Weaver's not terrible. Ghast is, I mean, Ghast is Ghast, you know what I mean? Like, it is what it is. I think, I think Witch is fine. It's actually a pretty weak healer if you don't have good mana gen, but I do have good mana gen. I could even potentially consider keeping this for the rest of the game. Or I could just grab the wizard to have a replacement for Spellblade. Perma boost is good. Huh. And Weaken is cool. I don't know, I like Witch, I think it's fine. We have so much defense already, I think it's fine. Like, I don't need to roll the, the specific big heal sides. I can just look for 
any of these three probably more so than anything. Poison. What am I looking for? I guess anything that... Do I want this one damage? Because then I can do two, two, one, kill that. But then, like, these are kind of bad. I mean, I say kind of bad, but they're not even that bad. I don't want weaken, though. If I can get weaken, that would be sick. I got the one anyways. I also kind of want to do one on the boss, though. But I think it's not worth I could do that. I think it's not worth. Probably still put the poison on the boss, but it's good enough. Bank the two. Slate is fine. I have the execute for Slate. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, shyster. Oh, no. I mean, in a way, it's not that bad. Like, I think a 5 heal cleanse might be better than a 2 mana most of the time. Copycat. I don't want less than that. Wait, I don't want six. I want five. I want to kill that. Maybe I don't care about killing that. Wait, not having vine is just a little bit annoying. Where's this going on? Is it cleansed? No, it's not. Wait. Is this really the best case scenario? I don't think so. Like, this probably is. Maybe this is. I think I'd rather not have a copycat. And just find more mana so I can actually kill the slade. Or poison. And this probably... I guess this could... I don't know. It's like, it's kind of okay. Like... It's not bad. So it's a little bit annoying, but... I could also do this. Where is that going? Yeah, I don't want I don't want Sparky Weekend. I think that's okay. Yeah, that's actually no. I should I should take that. My team is so good that it probably doesn't matter. Ghost. I actually rolled the cleanse side. I kind of do want the cleanse though. Maybe more so than this. Actually, maybe maybe it is this. Like, I don't know. How do I kill ghosts? I actually have uh, I have way less options now than before. H. I think that's actually fine. I mean, this can pop the ghost, I guess. There's not that many options otherwise. I couldn't just burst it. Guarantee that's gone. Only Wanderer can one-shot it. I guess the stick could, but that's about it. <laughs> that double cleanse is funny as well. Yeah, that's pretty annoying. I 
think I will lock that. So what is this? It boost is a keyword, right? Yeah. Maybe I want to copy at cleanse. But I guess it doesn't matter because it's probably it's probably about the same. I gotta kill Basalt soon. It's gonna spawn right, yep. Well I got the stick. Which actually doesn't do anything, but and I guess it might. Yeah, it does. Can't pop that, but I kill it through. Oh shit, I can't. <laughs> well, I guess it dies to poison, then it flees, right? Wait, I can. Just do that. Holy bolt is good. Oh wait, cleanse is really insane. I think I should take it because cleanse in that fight was crazy. I think it's just better. Like, I don't really need more damage, right? Like, it's cool, but I mean, it's really insane. But this is also really insane because then poet just starts going crazy. Like, you can pre cleanse. I can cleanse everybody. It's so clutch because I'm I'm removing this. I only have one cleanse. Like poison could kill me. Yeah, no. It, it's just it's got to be this. Like there's just I, I'm my position is too good right now. Tome. I think tome is okay. I think revive potion is terrible, but I mean if it's adding three illusions, I think that's worth it. I get free mana off of them, so I'm basically spending one mana. I think it's fine. I can just take it. Just for this potentially. You never know. Could hit roulette. Which would be bad, by the way. Is this worth it? I would even put it here, maybe, just to have the solve online permanently. I think it's worth it just for Tome. Oh, that self cleanse. Whoa. Okay, whoa, that, that's kind of interesting. I mean, I don't need it in this fight, so for now we'll just keep it offline. Alright, who the hell. Wait, this is actually. Wait. Oh no, it copies the base side. <laughs> okay. I mean, in a way, it is better, though. It's like, I already have so much cleanse. I think it is better. I don't know, is one giga heal better? I already have like, giga shield, well... I think AoE shield is better than a giga heal. Oh wait, I don't know, that's a close one, not sure. Holy yikes. I mean, they are they are buffed up because small enemies are stronger. Good double boost. Let's see. Did that ever play? I don't think so, but maybe. What doesn't do anything? I mean, I'm kind of okay with this. I 
I'm pretty sure self cleanse works on the like it wouldn't kill itself, I think. Pretty sure. Actually, I'm not 100% sure on that. I think it does. Why would it not? Ah. The problem is I don't have many options to destroy all the wisps except for that. I think I have to take the risk. If it dies, it dies. Actually, if it dies, I'm fucked. I don't know. I don't know. Alternative is this. That's just better, safer. Okay. Yeah, I I, I don't want to mess with that. Like I don't know. I just don't know. I'm pretty sure that it self cleanses before it takes the damage, but who knows? Is that a keep? The five self shield, yeah. Holy guacamole. And low key, I just keep Spellblade for the rest of the run. Come on, guys, don't let me down. Maybe that's fine. Maybe that's worth it. I'm still gonna, I don't know, I'm gonna do that just in case, but it doesn't really matter. Like, this could roll cantrip and kill itself, technically. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a possibility. Maybe it'll stick here. Charge. I might actually keep Spellblade until the end of the run, I don't know. <laughs> and Dabbler, Dabbler is definitely not as good as Spellblade. And Ghast is certainly not better than Sparky. Is it? Wait, maybe it is actually, I can just, oh yeah it is. I can just replace the, oh wait, that's actually sick. Now I have more weaken, which makes us even safer, and I have... This is like the perfect ghast, actually. Holy shit. I should take it. If there's any moments where ghast is good, it's gonna be this one. Now, obviously, it's not like... It's not the most spectacular thing you've ever seen, because I'm losing the charge, but I already have charge here, so... Gas spell is pretty decent. I don't know, gas spell is like, eh. I'm mostly taking it for the weekend, I guess, which is fine. That's a gas right there. Is that not the perfect being? Except for the spell being shit, but <laughs> whatever. Yeah, if the spell wasn't wasn't dog shit, it would be pretty good. I mean, it's not it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Just some bosses just don't care at all. I'm looking for like a poison unit or something. 
to replace Spellblade maybe, otherwise I'll just keep it. Got the four. Do I want mana, poison, or weaken? No. I don't want mana. Recharge. Sure, honestly, why not? Got four. Cool. Stupid whiz. Whoa. I mean, that's crazy. Copycat, cantrip, self shield, cleanse, self cleanse. <laughs> what? Like, what the hell is happening? <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> okay, anyways. Whoops. Uh, actually, no, I kinda, I, I'm kind of okay with that. I'll just go here, 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 here. Here. It's a really clean run here. Ooh, second heart angel. Oh my. Oh my god. Oh wait, it's already. I can't. <laughs> That's so close to being like busted as hell. Might still be okay. I can just do. I can just slap it on wander. I guess. I, although I might just grab second heart and just say, okay, I'm just not dying. Second Heart Witch or something. Like Angel Feather can go on Wanderer, but it's really not that good. I'm trying to think of situations where it would be good. Like very, very narrow at this point, because I'm already like these two are definitely not. I mean, I guess you could argue I should just Remove karma, maybe, and put it on like, put it here. But it's, it's not, it's not even good. Now I think, I think karma is better than feather. I mean, no, it's it's not necessarily better. But who holds karma then? I don't know. Second second heart is really not that good. Like it just goes on gas, maybe. Like on spell lane. It wouldn't go on Wander because Wander is already like invincible. So, I mean, I could see it. The only issue is that I don't know. There's no issue, right? I should do it. I feel like I'm already invincible, but whatever. Uh, there's no reason not to become even more invincible, I guess. Like, it's not. Oh, it's not horrible. Fine. It's it's not that bad. Can't say it's like great, but this might be the most insane defensive comp I've ever had. <laughs> it's uh actually well, I I guess I should say most consistently good defensive comp because well it also has good damage, but. The one with the infinite regen is good, but it has potential to die because it requires mana. This one doesn't. Like, this one you just do whatever. <laughs> just keep rolling, you roll auto cleanse, cantrip, copy, shield everybody, cleanse everybody. Like, just a little bit too crazy. Yeah, the save charge is probably better. I guess I'm more so looking for a week in here. If I... Probably do lock this, I don't know. Eh. Yeah, why not? Gives me the safety of not needing anything else. Copycat charge, it's still like kind of bad. One down. 
One to go. What? Oh. It's not enough. Oh. Funny how that works, eh? That's enough. Oh wait, that will kill itself, right? <laughs> With the guilt. The handle. Okay, the hand means the feather could be good on the Wanderer. But it's very... I mean, it's just worse than this, right? Okay. This is the true, the true moment where I have to consider stuff. But I think, I think Spellblade is better. Three mana, synergize with charge. The only problem with it is the low max HP. But if it gets one shot by the hand, then it gets one shot by the hand, right? Like it's just not, not much different. Also, copycat. Yeah, it's just better. Skip. All right, now let's uh, let's be honest here. If the hand rolls insta kill, that is not good. That is, in fact, very bad. Maybe somebody wants to carry this just in case. Like maybe oh, it's right. Oof, it's not right. Most. Ugh. Dirty. I guess I can do it. Well, well, no, I was going to put it here, but this <laughs> is I think I might. Wand of wand. No, it's fine. I think we're fine. Actually, no, my damage output is not that good. That's the only weakness of my team comp is the damage output is not that good. I need the poison. Oh, I'm scared. I am a bit afraid. I won't be dying unless the hand rolls. Kill the upside. And if it rolls... So the only way I'm losing this is if it rolls kill topside twice. That's the only way I'm losing this. And that is a little bit scary to think about. So I almost want to equip this like and just put it like on gas or something just in case. Or at least equip the wand of wand on somebody, but who, nobody nobody can hold it. Their their middles are too good, other than gas. But gas is holding. Yeah, no, I I can't I can't. I can see the problem here. I can see the problem. Like there's um. That's why I was looking for poison, but I, I do have poison, so it's like I don't want to replace it, because there's poison. There's also charge one shot potential, but like. That's not consistent either. I'm a little bit terrified. But, um, I mean, there's only one side. I would have to roll it twice in a row for me to be in a, in a bad spot, so... Okay. Well, I need to roll... I need to roll poison now, probably. And I need to roll defy as well. I think I need to keep this charged because actually, no, maybe not. Well, I the thing is, I want to keep this because Wander can roll a 10. Oh, no, it's a, it's a 7. Okay, never mind. Then I want to roll everything then. The only reason to keep the charge is if I think it's relevant to kill the hand, but it's not. Need poison. 
this side probably wants to roll mana. I just have to go for the high roll at this point. I mean, it's better than most things. Am I really trying to roll for poison? I mean, this this is good, but like, it's not great. I guess I could always roll. The problem is, even charge is not great. Part of me just wants to roll this again, but... I guess I could do, I could hold this. Uh, ah. I think I have to hold this. It's just like, I don't know if going for a high roll here is worth much. Just lock these two, roll this, try to find. I don't know. Poison would be the only thing that's worth it here, other than charge. I mean, charge would be good, but it's not that much better than this. No, charge is not even that much better than this, so I should lock that. There's worse, though. Like, this is worse, right? So I have to... I think I'm rolling. I mean, I could also just pass. I could, I could hold here. Let's go here. Here boost because it's gonna die anyways go here here damn i can't even execute that i guess i could if i don't boost that's probably worth it who's boosting then boost mana boost mana wait i can't oh yeah i can do this i can boost mana I hate that both my DPS units are at the top. That's so bad. I mean, I got maximum value. There's not much I can do. I have to burst down the wander now. At the hand, I mean. All right, GG. I've equipped it. Was it a mistake to not equip the potion? I mean, it's not over, but it's like, fuck me, man. This, this, sh okay. I'm going to say it straight up. This should not be in the game. This should be single use. Or exert. I'll take an exert. There's no way in hell that you should have a boss that can just insta-kill two of your units with no counterplay. In a row, in a row. Like, I only need one turn. I only needed one singular turn there, and I would have been fine. Alright, now I really have to high roll. I gotta roll for mana every turn. God, if this bricks, I'm so screwed. I guess I should hold this. I mean, it's better than nothing. Any damage is better. Uh, I need this to roll mana, please. Okay. I'm so far away. And the ghosts are spawning too. Oh. Fuck me, man. Like, actually, fuck me. So disappointing.
guess if it never rolls. But like, how am I gonna deal with the ghost? It's like, it's so much. Oh, and I lost my- oh shit! I lost my mana bank. Oh, that's really bad. Oh, I, I really didn't expect it to, to nuke me twice. I should have moved that item. Wait, nobody can hold it though. I didn't have a choice. I, I can't win, right? Like, I just can't win. I'm not sure how to win here. I need Poet to roll the mana side, I guess. I... I don't know. The charge side probably, like... I probably can't use mana here because I need the charge side to be big. Probably. But I also kind of need to kill the ghost. I think the poison's going to be a... well... Oh, maybe it's fine, I don't know. I I can't waste damage. I think I need I need the damage, that's the issue. I actually need the damage. <sighs> it's all poet, it's all poet. Like poet has to roll this cantrip side, poet has to roll like as long as it starts summoning maybe as well. Why are you fucking hitting me every turn? Summon, please. That's not even enough. Holy shit. How am I getting away from ghosts here, killing me? I think I have to like... But how do I ever farm a ghost? I don't have the damage. I, I just don't have the damage distribution to ever farm the ghost. I don't have the damage distribution to ever farm a saber either. I I don't I don't know like this might actually make me quit slice and dice I'm not I'm not even joking like this is this actually feel like usually I'm okay with RNG fucking me in the ass but like this is not okay I think because everything else is mitigatable like if you just have if you're just taking damage like nothing is unavoidable in this game like there's I guess I just made the wrong choices in character selection. I don't know. It's just like I I should have played around the hand double killing top and then take a character that can actually kill. The like gas just cannot do anything here. And I'm slowly dying. I mean, I have to hit this side eventually. Otherwise, I'm probably dead. Or the mana side. I have to hit the mana side or the maybe it's worth rolling the. But then like I might not be able to save the poet. That's the problem. If I roll this and it rolls I mean, it's just, it's saving me 2 HP here and here, so the only thing that's better is this. I think, actually, I think boost is better. The only thing worse is this. I think at this point I have to roll for it. Yeah, I, I have to roll for it, right? It's just, I, I don't see an out. I need to high roll. This is staying, but this has to roll one of the... So boost, shield all, or mana. And if it doesn't roll it, then I just lose, but I mean... I don't know, it, it is what it is, right? Like, I, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die to this, so... I do not think this, like... Everything going that low is pretty devastating, I think I, I can't... 
It's really bad. Okay, that's better. Yeah, that's way better. I guess I gain three, or do I just... I should knock the ghost. Uh, I need to kill the ghost. It's it's not happening. There's too, there's too many... There's going to be too much damage coming every turn. Like, this needs to stop rolling this. Like, okay, there are two sides that... Okay, I guess it rolls this, I lose. But, like, okay, at least it's not rolling this. <laughs> I just... I should be grateful that it's not rolling that. I get one extra mana for killing stuff, so... I need this to roll cantrip. Mana. Yeah, that's good. That's good as well. God, man, can you stop? Is that enough? Oh, fuck no, it's not. <laughs> what a disaster. I mean, at this point, I might as well kill it, right? Fuck you, man. Just roll these sides, please. Any of these, please. Not this. Or, I mean, I guess not this, but like... Holy shit. I need this to roll mana, I guess. Well, I, can you can this roll mana a single time, please? Like, holy shit! What a pain in the ass! I just can't afford to do anything. I'm just barely surviving. Okay, finally, but now it's like it's like almost too late. Okay, that's good. I can go here, here, here. Here. Oh wait, now oh now it's just so okay wait, this is bad. Cause I kinda need the weekend, but I kinda need the shield, you know what I mean? Like it's just it's fucked. Poison's fucking me too. Hmm. Let me think about this. So doesn't this just save everybody anyways? Yeah it does. Okay, so I don't need this. I have to roll this, I think. I need the cleanse. Wait, doesn't that mean I can roll this too for the weekend? This this can stay. Alright, so I mean I guess the sabers are not I, I like I could I could just say, okay, you're summoning sabers, but they're going in the background, so. Like, maybe that's fine. Maybe I still do this? I don't know. I don't have to kill the ghost necessarily.
Wait, there's no way to save that? This will get cleansed by Poet at some point. Why is it hitting gas? That's such a pain. I think I just have to let it summon. I'm just going to ignore the ghosts and just let them stack. I hate that I lost my bank as well. My plus one. I guess I could have put it here if I just moved the... Okay, finally. Well, now... Okay, good. Okay, mana side is good. Okay, finally. Wait. Wait, that's a lot of poison. And you're dying as well. Um, would I rather face a saber or a ghost? That's a really interesting. I think saber is easy. Eh. How much damage is this? Wait, I need to check Saber. Eight, five, 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 twelve death. Six. I think I think Ghost is easier. I think I might just do, do this. Pretty sure Ghost is easier. Do I have to waste the weekend here? I think I have to because it's like it's too much poison pressure here with the ghost targeting witch. Actually, maybe it's fine. Let me think. Maybe I don't care. Oh wait, but somehow it's also. Wait, why is Gast? Oh, Gast has poison from the previous turn. Oh. Oh yeah, that's a problem. Yeah, that's a problem. That's that's the issue. Maybe the ghost is actually helping me here. Okay, that's not good. Oh my god, finally, finally, poet, finally. Okay, now the problem is that's not enough. And I don't think... Uh, should I roll for weekend? I don't think so. I could also blank twice, but... Wait, gas is taking... Okay, wait. Wait, let me lock this. How much is gas taking? Eight? Depends if I hit the cleanse, right? So... I guess otherwise I could always hit the charge and it's still fine. I'll just be on four poison, but... It's not a huge deal. I'm trying to think. It might... Hmm. I mean, I'm definitely keeping that heal side from which I think. One of the better sides. I guess the weaken would be better. The boost could be better. It's not that good, actually. Now that I think about it. Because witch cannot over... Like, it's... Okay, it's worse than the... I mean, it's a little better than the shield. I think it's worse than the weekend. Yeah, it's worse than the weekend. It's uh, it's actually exactly the same as the mana. Boost is the most interesting part here because boost can do this, which would be cool. So boost weaken shield is like slightly worse, but also like it's not that bad. I think I always lock this though, just in case. If I'm rolling witch, I should lock this then. So this rolls anything, we're good. As long as this also rolls something. Let me just calculate this again. So we have this. If this rolls charge, save everybody. If this rolls this, we're in really good shape. 
Wait, are we? Yeah, we're in really good shape. But then Witch would rather roll something else, right? But she's still taking plus three actual damage. So that shield would save her, but... Then I would have to use a burst, which is not great, but... I just, I don't think that keeps me alive enough. That's the thing, right? Like, I need to get rid of the poison somehow. And the best way to do it would be with which side. I think I roll. This world cantrip, which is really clean here. Worst case, I can kill a ghost, I guess. Uh, if, if put bricks, I'm screwed though, but that's always the case, no matter what. Okay, how's that? Terrible. That's actually terrible. Fuck, Poet, why the fuck did you cantrip shield yourself, you fucking moron? Ah, I'm pissed. Okay. It's not good enough. Like, I can... No, it's not good enough. Good. So Poet really has to roll something here. That's not good enough. Now the question is, do I roll the witch again? I mean, anything's better than that except for blank. But again, at this point in my situation, I don't know if I have the luxury of not rolling it because, like, either way, I'm gonna I'm gonna get screwed. The weekend would be best case scenario, I think. Uh, I don't think the gas can roll. Too risky. So again, the three shields better. Weakens better, boost is... Boost is like, okay, because it adds the mana, right? So it's like, it's equivalent to rolling a four mana, which is fine. I mean, so it's all, it's all poet anyway, so poet breaks it, it's over. Cool. Oh, it did not brick. But we're still kind of in a bad spot. Hmm. Halfway hand. Witch is dying, but I mean, she has a lot of survivability. If, if Witch hits a uh, heal cleave, it's fine. Okay, that's a good turn for me. Good. Oh wait, that's not the right one, but... Do I want that? Do I ever do this? I don't think I'm... I don't... I think I'm supposed to leave the sabers. Uh... I mean, there are already four reinforcements. It's not like... Uh, it's not like weakening that is that good. I think I should roll for mana. I don't know how I'm ever getting out of this situation, honestly, without Harvest. Like, Harvest is just never activating. That's the issue. Everything is even HP. I don't think that Ghast... Weakening that is super good. Also, I'm pretty sure Witch has to roll here. Yeah. So you're staying. Witch is rolling. Witch rolls weaken. That's better. I think I just have to roll for mana here. I need damage. I'm going to have to deal with the sabers as they come, which is... Not going to be easy for sure, but... The ghosts are pretty big. I'm hoping they just take up the space. I, I really don't see a way out of this situation, to be honest. 
So, I mean, there's always a way. It's like very, it's going to be very specifically me rolling cantrip mana, rolling mana here, and then charge shield, protecting everything. Like, it's always doable, but it's very unlikely. I think I might have to accept the hand summoning another three here. Just because the weaken can hit the poison, it might it might be more clutch. I, I don't know. Actually, is that true? Maybe it is fine to use it. But I do have to roll this. I'd rather roll the weaken on this, obviously. I almost want to roll put, you know what I mean? Like, just so I can roll the cantrip mana. But I think it's just bad. I don't know if I don't know if weakening that is good or not. I I think it is. I'm pretty sure it is. It also puts it in harvest range, which is kind of relevant. But if I roll man, I can I can burst twice. It's four damage, which is good. And I might need the weaken for the Giga Cleave as well. Yeah, I think I can't I can't do it. I gotta roll both of these, I think. That's better. How are you still poisoned? What the hell? No cleanse, eh? Okay. I mean, at this point, it is what it is, right? Yeah, at this point... Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm just lucky the ghosts suck, so that's all I can say. But I need this to roll weekend, I think. I mean, I guess that's like kind of good. Let's do this. Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay, I mean, if you want. If you fucking want, just keep going. Why don't you? Mana, okay, that's good. I think I'm. I think I'm rolling pull it. Why? Why would I? Why would I not? Right? Because it either rolls better, or it rolls blank and it can still save my unit with salve. Yeah, I, I need to. I need to roll. This is fine, but this has to roll better. That's better. I mean, that's better, but that's not like... <laughs> I don't know if that's that much better, honestly. I might... Oh. Instead of dealing damage here. I don't know, actually, maybe, maybe I do need to do damage. Yeah, it puts that 8 range. 8 range is good. Wait, why is it at 5 mana? Oh, boost. 8 range is good, because if I roll the 2 mana, I think it's... 
Actually, it's not quiet, but... Maybe it's not worth. So yeah, 8 damage is hard, right? Like... I would have to roll the pain side. This is 3 mana, so that'd be... 2 plus 3, 5 plus 2, 7. I would not have lethal, so... I guess it's pointless. Could have lethal with this, but... Or this. There are two sides, but it might kill the rest of my team. That's the issue. I can't I can't really afford to do that. And since I would be on an odd number anyways, might as well use that. Because this always generates three goes to six, so it's kind of similar. I don't know. I actually don't know. I think it's... Uh, I don't know. Because, like, I have to consider the, the plus one on this as well, which is relevant. There's a very small chance. So what if I hit, okay, what if I go to two, I hit boost, I go, I go plus five, that goes to seven, which is the same thing. This would have to roll counter for me to kill it. So it's exactly the same. Uh, well, let's say I go to three plus five, eight, so this rolls counter if I kill it anyways. Yeah, that's probably just, that's better. Yeah, we are stuck here forever. Holy shit, it's still going. Does that work? I mean, it kills the hand, but it's like, at what price, right? I don't even think it's worth killing the hand here. I'm probably rolling this and then keeping both of these for self. And I can potentially kill the hand if I roll something good like charge. This rolls charge, I'm I'm actually in a decent spot. I mean at this point, it's kinda like I just get stuff out of range and then that's about it, right? I guess I could kill a ghost, but that summons two sabers, right? Wait, does it? Oh, it summons one saber. Oh, wait, these are big. I should definitely kill that. Problem is I have to... That was a really bad roll, honestly. But it's not as bad as... It might be better than the... Yeah, it is better than the... Uh... Okay, this is a little bit scary. But at least my team's alive. Ex one's exerted. I can probably kill the hand next turn. Problem the problem is that Poet now can't rescue, most likely. So it's on which to roll the heal side. But I also need the mana to kill the hand. This is... Uh, this is problematic, actually. It's not that good, because this is taking way too much damage. I might have to leave the hand at higher HP. Uh, no, it's so unfortunate. This is hitting it exactly for even... So it's really, it's also bad, like, everything's bad here. Yeah, I have to do it. Alright, anyways, it's always RNG every turn anyway, so, but the, the hand is most likely dead. The problem is, once the hand is dead, I don't think I have a good shot at winning either. Because everything gets neutralized. Like, I go down. Pretty sure... Okay. I think boost is okay. Because it does generate more mana, which means that this hits higher. The only thing that's better than boost is this side. I think. Yeah. Keep the boost. Oh, 
Holy shit, I almost lost there. Okay, that is... That is not it. Okay, so I guess I just let him summon three more. At least this is going here, which is good. This is pointless, right? I can't. I can't win. I, I don't. I don't see. A, I don't see an out really. Once this dies, it's like not even. Oh, that's good though. To start. Let the nightmare begin. I think I get one mana from this, which is good. At least there's a ghost. I, I'm just happy there are ghosts still. I need them to roll like death at the right time. Holy shit, that is not death, but... I need charge. And mana, obviously. Wow, I actually got through that just to die right after. That sucks. <laughs> that is very unlucky, actually. I could have survived this if this rolled a singular charge side. Actually, maybe even maybe I couldn't even do that. I don't know. Um. I'm actually pretty angry. I, I'm gonna be honest. This is uh, actually kind of disgusting. I feel like I feel like that needs a rebalancing. That doesn't. It doesn't make sense that you can just like randomly lose to like a a one in six twice with no counterplay. I, I don't know. It's just like it's. It feels disgusting. Like it actually feels disgusting. It's very unfun, unrewarding. That was the only way I would lose too. Like, I. Uh, like. My character picks were not great, though, to be honest, but. I don't think there was, like. Sure, I could have rolled into Sorcerer, which would have been better. Maybe picking the. Like, the problem is, I roll into Ace, it's the same problem. I roll into Weaver, it's probably the same. Yeah, no, it's even worse, because the single use just falls off immediately, so. If I ran him there, I have a 50-50 chance of finding Warlock, which would have been better, and Sorcerer, which would have, been, would have been better. So these two are better. The two picks, these two picks did not matter. I could have tried to roll for Poison, but it was so unlikely that it was probably not worth it. There's only, yeah, there's only one unit here that would have been better. It would have been Venom because of Poison. Uh, this is the same scenario where nothing actually mattered. Yeah, nothing matters here. I guess I could have rolled for Valkyrie. I guess I could have rolled for Valkyrie. I don't know. It's like, it's so random though. It doesn't really... What was my tier 3 gray? It was... Uh... Yeah, Poet's really good. Like, why why would I not roll, keep a Poet? Like, it's only bad against... Okay. And all of this is even assuming I hit the hand in the first place, right? For, for this to be a, for this to be quote unquote bad character picks, I would have to hit the hand in the first place. Nothing else is a revive. I I guess maybe okay maybe picking witch was wrong, but it felt it felt right at the time. I mean nothing. Okay, again, all the reds probably make no difference there, other than other than surgeon. So it would be a random for Surgeon when I had other things that could roll poorly. I don't know, it's just like... It's very disgusting. Alright, well...
that actually pisses me off. I feel like my curse selection was good. This run. I, I don't I don't regret anything. Really. Uh, the only things I regret are hindsight, where I should have just rolled aggressively for like a actual damage mage to beat the hand, but like Again, that's assuming it even kills both of my units in two turns. Which shouldn't be happening most of the time. What were my yellow? What? Wait, what oranges did I skip? Dablis is terrible. Okay, I skipped that. I skipped Assassin, right? Which would have... Okay, can somebody tell me how dodge works against the execute? Does it work? As in, like... Do you actually dodge that effect? Because if so, I guess maybe that was the mistake. Where this has poison and also has... Dodge. I just don't know if it works. If it, if it does work, then sure, that was probably the misplay this run, but... Again, that is even assuming it kills my unit turn one and I don't roll poison on... Like, the poison side is equally as likely to appear whether I roll this or I keep the... the uh, spell lane. I could have rolled for the poison. Maybe. But, like, one in six, I don't know. It's just like, this side was really good on that turn because I get the extra mana. I'm allowed to, like, do more damage. Immediately, if it rolls this, this, or this, it's worse. So it's 50-50 to roll the same or different. Oh, man. It's so... Ah. All this effort for nothing. For absolutely nothing. It, it, it leaves, like, a very sour taste in my mouth that... I spent so much time like I'd rather lose in a different way like not not like this like I'd rather lose because you know I'm getting hit by like a bunch of units and I just my team comp isn't that great and then like you know my fucking healer dies and then I just lose the game like that's that feels e that feels better because usually that means multiple things went wrong at the same like it's like a bunch of things going wrong at once but it's not innately a singular unit rolling one side that fucks you over, right? It's like... I mean, it can't happen, but... There's not one side that just says you lose the game, right? It's gonna be like a combination of multiple damage sides hitting specific units, multiple AoEs happening at the same time. But it's always multiple. It's not just one unit rolls a singular side and you're dead. And I, I just... I just do not... I do not understand why that side is designed the way it is like is it just there i guess it is literally just there to punish people randomly which sucks because it, it, i don't know i don't I just, uh, I'm, I'm actually puzzled by that design design decision to put a side like that on the hand when it's already a, a boss that is very difficult like it is the hardest boss in the game already but it also has a way to just end your run. One in six every turn. Like, why not make it so, like, anything? Give it a downside. Make it so the boss takes damage equal to the HP of the unit, you know? Like, maybe make it exert itself maybe single use maybe i mean i would say single use is totally reasonable i, I don't know why that's not a thing but um maybe give the other heroes vigil or something you know like anything to make it more interesting than just you're dead anyways um I... I don't know. I... I don't know. I'm just... I'm, I'm, I'm extremely sad, like...
losing any other way would have felt better, essentially. Like, it just feels like my entire time trying as much as I can to play well, to make the right decisions, just ended up not mattering at all. In a, in a very, like, again, I'm, I have to stress this, like, in a very specific manner, like, when I lost to the blind, it was annoying. But it's like, okay, I picked a curse that gives the blind plus one pip on the left side. Okay, that makes sense, right? Like, it's, it's part of my decisions that ended up, you know, screwing me over in a way, right? So I was, I was like, I, mentally, you're kind of like, okay, I picked this curse, it screwed me over, okay. But I didn't choose to face the hand, and I didn't choose for the hand to roll left side twice in a row. That's the issue. Is that that's not something I interacted with in any way. And, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know what to say, like, I know people probably will want me to play more. And, uh, I do want to. I might end up... I don't, I don't know, like, I want to, but I also don't want to, because... I think... I mean, if I'm going to do this again, I'm definitely not going to... Okay, unless... I Basically, I'm just going to play as fast as possible until we get back to, like... 7, 8 streak. But I, I just can't... I don't have it in me anymore to spend, like, two and a half hours, three hours, potentially. Um, just sitting there searching for the best play. If I, if I don't see it immediately, I'm just going to accept that the run is lost or something, you know, like... It's just, um, it's very disheartening. That's all I have to say. Like, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's very, it's like a, it's like a slap in the face, a big one too. I don't even know. I don't, again, I want to know what the purpose of that side is from a developer standpoint, because I, I almost see no reason for it to, like, it's, sure, it's just an RNG, okay, you're dead, like, if that's the reasoning, then that sucks, I guess. Like, why, why would you want that in your game? Why would you want people to feel levels of frustration that are, like, even higher than your base, like, the, the core game can already be frustrating because you're going to lose to RNG at some point, right? You're, you're going to lose to bad luck at some point. But why add on to that in a specific manner, right? Like, why in this specific manner? Anyways, uh, that's going to do it for me. Um, honestly, I might just jump back in right away just to, like, I don't know. It, it might be a mistake, but mostly, I, I just want to, like, get a win in quickly just maybe that'll change my mind i don't know anyways thanks for watching sorry for being a crybaby and ranting about design or game design or whatever like but yeah it i don't think i've i don't i don't actually know if i've ever felt worse playing a game than, than I do right now, honestly. I don't, it's hard to... I played League of Legends, too. Holy shit. Anyways, see ya.